Hey guys, one of the things that I think is overlooked when we're talking about making a meatloaf or experimenting with meatloaf is um, that, God, I'd say 60% of the experience is the texture. Just that perfect meatloaf texture. There's nothing like it. Um, if you find that yours is falling apart or you just haven't made it before and you want to make sure that you avoid it falling apart, uh, there is really one thing to keep in mind and that is the relationship between your binders um, which is usually breadcrumbs, but I've got other pages on here and I'll talk about alternatives in a second that give you alternatives to breadcrumbs. Um, and your wet ingredient, your eggs, mostly the amount of eggs that you use. If you find that your uh, meatloaf falls apart too easily, add an extra egg next time. That almost always takes care of it. Um, if for some reason it was on the other side of it, um, your binder might just not be the right binder for you, particularly if you're using one of the alternatives um, like cornflakes or like uh, cooked oats or whatever. Um, but try to work out a better uh, relationship between those two ingredients and you'll probably sort out the issue that you're having with your uh, crumbly falling apart meatloaf. But a crumbly falling apart meatloaf is better than no meatloaf. Enjoy.